I'm gonna show you one of my favorite ice cream desserts that makes you feel a little bit better about eating it. What's up guys? Hey everyone, welcome to our channel today you guys. We hope you're all doing well, staying healthy, staying safe. But we are really excited for today's vlog. We haven't done one of these in a while and we know you guys love them, but we are definitely in need of a shopping trip for groceries. We've been out of things for quite a while. As you guys know, we were out of town a little bit. But now we are back home and we need to stock up. And with it being so warm outside now, it's summer, the weather's hot, so we need to get a lot of yummy summer foods. So we thought it'd be really fun to bring you guys along with us. And I'll be showing you guys some stuff that I like to get for my vegan diet. A few of you guys asked if I'm doing the vegan diet as well. I'm not. I definitely eat more veggies and things like that because we have more in the house, but I still do eat a little bit of meat and some cheese and some things like that. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, you guys, he has loved it. Seriously, I have so much respect for him because it is hard and he just like, even I can be sitting there eating a burger. This has happened. I've been <laughs> sitting there eating a burger from somewhere and he's just eating his food and like it doesn't even phase him at all. It's incredible. Nope. If you don't know what we're talking about, we just put out a vlog where Jared announced that he has lost 30 pounds in just three months, which is crazy. Boop, boop. And he feels amazing and it's all due to going vegan. We'll link that video here, go check it out. But for now, we gotta get into the grocery stores. So we gotta put on our masks and get shopping. All right, guys, we are going to Harmon's. It's one of our favorite grocery stores here in Utah. In fact, I think it's only in Utah. We want to ask you guys, what are grocery stores like around your parts of the world? Are they open? Is social distancing still a thing? Do they require masks or strongly encourage them? Yeah, what's the deal? One thing that we love about Harmon's, you guys, is that they actually sanitize the carts before you even grab them. So they have a guy there full time sanitizing every single cart before you grab it, which is really cool. Another quick and simple thing that we love about Harmon's, you guys, is that they know it's a pandemic right now and that fresh food is kind of slim, so they've already pre-packaged a ton of really healthy meals. And they're so yummy. You guys, check out this selection of sushi they have. is this watermelon mint cold pressed juice. So, so good. All right guys, an absolute staple during summer for us is fresh fruit. We love strawberries, blueberries, blackberries, raspberries, and then I think I spy some cherries over here. And those are my absolute favorite. But comment down below, what is your favorite summer fruit? We want to hear. I eat a ton of vegetables. I absolutely love them, obviously. But if you guys just do a quick Google search, you can actually find out which vegetables have the most protein, and you'll be shocked how much protein certain vegetables have, like broccoli. <laughs> Seriously though, like broccoli, you guys, like it has so much protein in it, asparagus does too. But I also have a few staples that I eat just because I think they're delicious. Zucchini being one of them, I think it tastes so good. It's so good fresh, it's so good cooked. You can also spiralize it and make it into a pasta, which is delicious. Let me grab you some zucchini, buddy. <laughs> I also love yellow squash for the exact same reasons. I do like spinach, but I do like iceberg lettuce more just because I think it tastes better. But spinach, you guys, does have a ton of good protein in it and lots of fiber. Closed 
for months with everything going on. But now we're at the stage where they can have that back open so we can pick up some fresh meat. for dinner, all sometimes adds some protein to it. A couple of our favorite flavors we love. This is just the Dole Caesar Chopped. That one's really good. We love the Greek. I'm gonna pick up one of these for sure. We also love the Sesame Asian. It's one of our favorite too. Jerry doesn't eat the stuff that's non-vegan with the dressing, so sometimes he'll put on a different vinaigrette for him, but usually everything that comes in the salad kit, a lot of them are vegan, which is really awesome. But then if it's not, you can just switch out the dressing as well. Okay, so a lot of you guys have asked what I like to eat. So I actually eat a ton of HelloFresh rice because it kind of has the texture of rice, but it tastes so good. So what I mix it with, you guys, though, is fresh salsa. And I also like to mix it with avocado. So I eat a ton of avocado. However, this is one little trick, you guys. I don't like preparing the salsa or the avocado. So I actually buy these little guys right here. They're already prepared. They taste delicious. That way I can just throw these onto my cauliflower rice and seriously, it tastes amazing. And the prep time is like next to nothing. So guys, another thing I like to get are these plant-based meats. Honestly, I have no idea what's in them, but they taste absolutely delicious. A favorite of mine is actually these Beyond Burgers. They are so good. They also make Beyond Sausages, which is something I have not yet tried, but I have tried another type of sausage that is also plant-based. So I'm gonna give this one a shot. But guys, seriously, they're absolutely delicious, super good for you, and they're 100% plant-based. All right, you guys, we're in one of our favorite aisles, the ice cream aisle. <laughs> and what says summer more than popsicles and ice cream? I'm gonna show you one of my favorite ice cream desserts that makes you feel a little bit better about eating it. But this is the Skinny Cow vanilla ice cream sandwiches. These are so good, you guys. So let me show you guys a comparison. So this is the oh so good fat boy that we all love, but there is nine grams of fat and almost 300 calories in one of these. Three grams of fat and 160 calories. So, so awesome. They both taste so good, but this is one of my favorites. Halo Top ice cream, you guys, is another one of my favorites. Comment down below, I wanna know, have you guys tried Halo Top and do you like it? And of course, I gotta pick up just regular Ben & Jerry's too. I'm curious, what is your guys' favorite vegan ice cream? If you guys have even heard of one or know of one, I would actually like to know because sometimes when it says dairy-free, it doesn't necessarily mean it's vegan-free. So if you guys know of one, drop it in the comments below because I would love to know. This is kind of funny. One of my favorite go-to freezer meals are these Lean Cuisine pizzas. You just pop them in the microwave, it takes about three minutes, and they taste so good. So since Jared's not eating pizza right now, this is kind of the perfect size for me because I can just pop one of these in when he's cooking a vegan meal. Okay, so a ton of you guys have asked what type of cauliflower rice do I like to get? So I actually like to get the one from Costco because it comes in these massive bags, it's super cheap. But when I'm in a hurry, I love grabbing this one right here. It's made by Green Giant. It is absolutely delicious. One of these has 75 calories total in it, which is so good. And then when I want something maybe a little bit more hearty, I get this one right here. So it's not made by Green Giant, it's made by Cascade Farms, but this one is really, really good in my opinion, just because it has bell peppers and onions in it. But I like eating this one and eating it for dinner or something like that. This with the guac and the salsa that I was talking about earlier, plus like a plant-based meat. Seriously, it's the most delicious meal and you guys will absolutely love it. Now, I will say this, you guys. A lot of people think that vegans eat nothing but like carrots and grass or something like that. 
but that's actually not the case you guys with the meal I just showed you guys it seriously tastes so good and you're gonna absolutely love a vegan diet once you eat it these are some of my favorite these are the multi-grain tortilla chips so <laughs> good with salsa now when it comes to snacks and chips you guys not everything is vegan just because it's like a potato chip doesn't necessarily mean it's vegan. You actually have to look for something that says vegan on it. So anyone who knows me knows that I love popcorn and this one in particular, you guys, says right on there, it's vegan. So that's just one little tip for you guys to remember when you're looking for stuff, just try to look for something that says vegan on it or check the ingredients. And before we touch anything, we have this awesome medical grade hand sanitizer with a pumper on it. Definitely hand sanitizing. Oh yeah, I gotta keep clean, baby. <laughs> awesome, shopping trip complete. Oh yeah. show when we were in there Jared had the camera on another aisle but one of my favorite things to eat during the summer are sandwiches so I make turkey sandwiches almost every day it's one of my favorite things and so I picked up some bread turkey I always like pickles on them and then tomatoes and lettuce that's kind of my go-to staple there we also always get some peanut butter and jelly for Jared so he can have PB&J sandwiches as well. While we were there, we also picked up a few groceries for my sweet parents because we still don't like them going out into public as much as possible. So we're gonna go ahead, drop those off really quick, and then head home. Uh -huh. 